Earlier this week, I received a call from the, um, the Chamber of Commerce, McAllen Chamber of Commerce, and they, um, they wanted to particularly say thanks to an officer that, in their view, uh, was worthy of thanks, uh, what they call a customer service award, when um, they saw him helping, a, helping an elderly lady cross the street. Now, I, was, I heard a little while ago from one of the officers that, that he actually put her there first so that he could get the award and then come help her. <laughs> and that's not the case, by the way. So, um, but I'll tell you how this conversation started and I received an email and I started reading through this and I saw an elderly lady in the email then I saw a McCallum police officer, oh, that's not good. Uh, and then I saw her, he stopped and uh, approached the lady and said, that's not even, that's not getting, that's not getting any better. And uh, I'm reading from the, from the message here that um, um, the observer, in this case a person um, or that was making the recommendation to the Chamber of Commerce, um, that she could tell that the old lady was nervous and that uh, probably she thought she was going to get a ticket because the officer uh, that was uh, approaching her was a motorcycle officer, one of our traffic officers. Um, so um, to the observer's relief, the officer was performing his duty and actually uh, got off his motorcycle to help this elderly lady and help her get across the street. It's a very busy intersection, Business 83 and South 10th Street. Uh, and they've asked to be here today to recognize the officer, give him thanks, and present him with what they call the Chamber of Commerce Customer Service Award. So what I want to do at this point in time is yield the, the podium over to um, Marta Cipriano, I think she is presenting for the Chamber of Commerce. And let me recognize our Chamber of Commerce President, uh, Mr. Uh, Steve Alanius, and Blanca Cardenas of, of the Chamber of Commerce staff, and, and all of you here, welcome to McAllen PD. Um, you were asked to do this uh, sometime soon, and this kind of just blended in well with what we're doing today. So thank you uh, for being our guests today. Let me call Officer Ted Silva up for a second. Ted? And, uh, and let me ask Marta Cipriano to come up here and uh, present you. Officer Silva. Hi, Marta. Good morning. Haven't hey. seen you in a while. It's been a while. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> it's so good to see you. Thank you. You know, that day that I was uh, at the intersection, actually, I think I was there maybe two, maybe even three lights that we waited. And that poor, sweet little old lady, I could tell she was a nervous wreck. She didn't know if her life was going to be in jeopardy trying to cross that busy intersection. I remember. And you turned around and you came back and I could not drive by. I actually had to turn around and it cost me another few lights to be able to come back. But I wanted to recognize you. And uh, you were the first one that, that, uh, that we presented that day. And there were others who were nominated, but your story was the one that got to everyone's heart. Well, sure, thank you. So congratulations on behalf of the McAllen Chamber of Commerce and its ambassadors. The presentation to you proudly of the Customer Service Ambassadors Customer Service Award, Officer Ted Silva. Thank you very thank much. You so much. Oh, thank you so much. It's, it's, always, it's always such a, a special treat to be able to catch someone doing something above and beyond the call of duty and I know you have a job to do but that was a really special treat for me it's a, a very special thing that I saw now you want thank to say you, something to well I think uh, thank you uh, Chamber of Commerce uh, for this award and uh, Martha for uh, well, I guess being there at the right time <laughs> but, but now I, we, we try to do all the, uh, those duties all the time uh, I don't think you know uh, sometimes we just happen to be at the right place at the right time but I try to do that all the time, you know, as a uh, police officer and a public servant to the city of McCallum. Absolutely. So, and I thank you guys very much. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.